Hey everyone, and today, well, well, first of all, welcome back to another video. Please like the video and subscribe. Uh, because today I'm going to do kind of like a workshop thing, not really, but uh, it's pretty much a tutorial how to edit, how I edit, upload, and create videos on a mobile device. <laughs> Okay, everybody, so, first of all, first of you all, you go here, onto your home screen, uh, I have an email, and I have a message from someone on Xbox, so, pretty much, as you can see, up here, in the top right corner, next to my battery, there's this little button, it's this little thing, and when you tap it, it says, would you like to stop screen recording? Yeah. So, how I do my videos is... How I do my videos is, is... Sorry, I had to do that. So, how I do my videos, you go down... You, well, you go to settings... And then you go to... Control Center. And you hit Customize Controls. Here, I'll just remove that for a second. And then you want to go down here to screen recording. Hit the plus icon. And then you can screen record. Now to start screen recording, you want to... Yeah, and it'll say screen recording saved to photos. You want to swipe. If you're on an iPad, you want to swipe from the top right corner diagonally down. And then you'll get to the control center. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hit this hit that button once and it'll go three two one and then it'll turn red and white like this and if it's blinking that means that it's recording but first you're gonna have to hit this button if you want it to capture your voice you're gonna want to hit this button microphone on so that means people can actually hear you now once you've done all that uh i suggest you go to imovie I believe devices actually come with this. Yeah, I... <laughs> oh, yeah, here's my smashing iPhone video. Uh, uh, okay. And then... Ah, go back. Okay, what you're going to want to do, you want to hit this plus button. I'm a little bit laggy. Sorry, excuse my lag, guys. Uh... Okay, I'm going to have to do all that in iMovie. So, I want to open iMovie. What? Oh, right. Uh, what is iMovie doing? Okay, guys, give me a second to get this cleaned up or not, because... Okay, so you're going to want to hit this plus button. You're going to want to hit movie. And then it will show you all of this. Am I still recording? Yeah, I am. Okay, it's, you're just going to show you all your videos in your camera roll. I ha and I have a lot of green screen effects. And, yeah, so what you do is you're going to want to tap the ones that you want to combine the video went to, and then you hit at the bottom, create movie. And now here, hey everyone, and today, you can see this, well, well, you can see that, and if I want to add, if you want to add something, then you, then you hit, if you want to add something, then you hit this plus button. You hit video or photos, recently added, for me at least, and this video coming soon and if you hit it twice really quickly it adds it in and like if I wanted to add this in if I wanted to add this in and record <laughs> if I wanted to add that in uh, all you're gonna have to do is tap on the one you want and hit the plus 
And then, <laughs> yeah, I was playing UMG in this untitled meme game. <laughs> and so, if you have green screen effects like I do, like these, if they're if they appear green, then that means it's called a green screen effect. Let me just delete these. So, if you want to add a green screen effect, you're gonna want to tap where you want to add it, split it, hit the green screen effect you want. Like, let's say I want to put in. Let's say I want to put in hey hey boy, then you instead of hitting the plus, you hit the three dots, hit green slash blue screen, and then you get this. Yeah. Hey <laughs> hey boy. Then you get that, and I have a few of these. Like if I wanted to add subscribe in right here, boom. You know I'm actually gonna keep my subscribe in. Bing. Yeah. Like this. So and then how it'll I will show that. And, yeah, so, and then you're probably going to say, well, Shu, how do you make your intros and outros? <laughs> and then my Minecraft intro. Okay, so what you're going to want to do for this is you want to download an app called IntroAid. You can only really do it like this. So you're going to have to flip the orientation, and then it'll get you with all of these. These are all the intros they have. If you remember, if you're an OG, this one right here was actually my first intro. This one. <laughs> That one was my first intro. This one right here, the one that I'm lo uploading right now, this is my Minecraft intro. That's my Minecraft intro. No, no, stop with the ads. And I believe this one was my old Ma Roblox intro. Now, there's a lot of these, and the ones that have the crown, you have to purchase, like, premium on it or something. <laughs> And, yeah, once you do that, once you choose an intro that you like, like, let's say I want to choose this one. That was actually pretty cool. So, then what you're going to want to do, if you're going to, if so, you hit the text. And so, let's say, I do that. Then I can go here and change the color. Or no, that's the, that's... Like this size. It's the size. Uh, here with all of these, I can change the color. Okay, yeah, ten percent remaining. Uh, I can change the color. And then here, you can change the font. Like this, I can do this. I believe the one that I used for Roblox was this one. No, it definitely wasn't this one. I think it was this one that I used for my Roblox intro. And then that's text again. And if you press the last button, that button right there. This is how I do my things. So I can make it fade in, slide right, slide left, slide up, slide down, fade right, fade left, fade up, fade down, spring right. And then let's say I want spring right. And then A, out, you have all the same options. Spring right. But you can also do these. Like, pop will do that. Rotate. That's what I do. And then rotate the other way. Jump. It just does that. Seesaw does that. And then heartbeat. And once you're ready, you're going to want to put this. Uh, if you want to make it longer, just hold the intro part and then drag. And then you play it. And that will appear. If you want to add stickers, like animation stickers, let's say you want to put a subscribe thing. Let's say I wanted to put subscribe right there. I could hit that. 
subscribe would only be at like the very end though. And now if I go back, what? Like Rocky. And then that button does that. Now if you want to export it, you hit the button in the top right corner. Hit that button, export resolution, and then it does this. It'll tell you save to camera roll. I'm gonna need to plug in my iPad. And then in camera roll, wherever I have it, it'll be right here. Okay, for some reason my text is upside down. I don't know. You go and after you do that, like let's say I wanna put my intro, cause like please like the video and subscribe. Uh, because today I'm going to do kind of like a workshop thing, not really, but, uh, it's pretty much a tutorial, how to edit, how I edit, <laughs> upload, and oh my goodness, I sound create like videos on a mobile device. God, I sound like such a douchebag. Okay, anyway, so you're going to want to hit split, you're going to want to hit this, wait, I forgot, I want to flip the orientation, this way for me is easier. And then you're going to want to go where your intro is. You're going to hit the plus button. And then mobile device. <laughs> then you have your intro. And once you're done with that and like this, if you have any green screen effects, you do that. And then what you are going to want to do is I don't know actually. Um, so what you are going to want to do is go here. Sorry if I sound like Kermit the Frog, even if I really don't. Wait, I already did this crap. And, yeah, that's pretty much how I edit. I use iMovie, IntroAid. They're pretty useful apps. Uh, they don't take up that, well, iMovie, as I hope you did enjoy this small little tutorial. If you did, make sure to like the video and subscribe, and I'll see you all again next time. I'll see you guys all again next time. Peace out, everybody.